Hey guys, welcome to a video about Sword of the Star the Pit, which is part of the Indie Real The Starry Night Bundle. So, it's probably the most important game of this bundle, so I'm going to show you what it's like. So I'm going to launch a new game, with, I'm going to go easy because it's easier <laughs> when you talk while fighting. So you've got three cl class here, you've got the Scout, the Marine, and the Engineer. And I'm going to go with the Engineer. Because it's got lots of electronic skills and mechanical and, and things, and it's, it's very useful because it's like uh, a Swiss knife. You can do everything with, with this one. The Marines is more like a warrior, a pure warrior. So it's all about fighting with him. And the Scout is definitely a rounded, uh, a rounded class. So pistol traps. It's a sneak. It's a. It's. It is a rug, in fact. Alright, so I'm going to go with the engineer. You can still improve your skill in yes, in any um, domain, in any kind of skill. You just need to to train a little bit. You don't begin with the same things. So here we go. I think it's, I think it's J. Yes, Anthony found what is that? So. I'm going to shoot this. It's a turn based RPG. Which is a. And it's a, rog it's a roguelike. So if you die, it's, it's the end. So I'm going to reload. Alright. You've got. you got to find, in fact, the, the cure for a, a disease which is affecting your people. And for that, you need to to go in the in the, de in the depth of, of the of this dungeon without dying. All right? What is that? I have a multi tool. Crap! As you can see, there is a line of vision, which is very important because you can't see behind you. All right, so but you can attack in diagonals. All right, let's forage this. I'm definitely not going to last long because it's my first game. I think I've just been. I've, I've just ah crap. I've just checked check this out a little. So what is that? Yes, cooker. I think I got plenty of. Materials that I didn't get in the in my first try, which was very short. I'd like to level up so I can ju just show you the character system. All right, so level up. Okay, so as you can see, you've got plenty of stats. You got earth experience, armor, food, radi radi ah, crap, radiation. And your your most important skill uh, stats are your might, fineness, and brain. Plus, you've got skills. You can just upgrade anything. I think lockpick, electronic, mechanical, computer, pistol, rifle, assault weapon, decipher knife, blade, traps, medical, fraging, and biotech. So it, it, it gives you a range of possibility within the level, which definitely change your your experience because if you begin with a warrior you're going to be a lot stronger so maybe you, you'll need less little things to help you progressing in the game but with a uh, uh, I don't know exactly uh, engineer uh, right engineer with the engineer you've got a lot of little things to help you and I believe that the scout is probably able to sneak and put straps so he can just uh, balance is lack of maybe power with this. All right, so some point in knife because I'm going to use this a lot, and maybe where is my pistol? All right. Okay, here we go. So I'm going to clear the first level. I'd like to be sure I don't forget anything.
and I'm going to meet more opponent. As you can see, when the game, you can run as you will if you are not in combat, but in combat you need to to, um, to do the tactical thing. <laughs> and one uh, move for each. Crap, what have I done? Alright, so this is that. Foot pellet. I got more here. This is definitely skill based. Uh, Alright. Where is that? Uh, I've got the friend here. Got the point is to eat first. And just don't let them the chance to to kill you. Alright, some ammo, which is good. I'm not using the gun unless I'm forced to. I should have used it for this. Maybe. So... Or my next enemy. You need to eat too. So you need to find a, a cooker and make your own meal to be able to survive this. Nah, no, it's already done. These are done too, right? I think this level is clear. And of course, the more you, the more you go deep in the dungeon, the most dangerous enemy are crap. Okay, and when you eat, you can damage your things. This little robot just. That speed decrease then all right. This little robot just uh, eat my armor, and I need to repair it now. And I need to repair my knife too because I damage it while uh, while fighting. So I've got plenty of tools. I've got a cooker which I've just got. Uh, I've got electric tool kit. I've got sharpening kit. So I'm going to use the sharpening kit to repair my knife. And here. Uh, is back to the full life. Uh, my jumpsuit is damaged too. I can just repair it with what? Maybe I don't have the the tool to do that. Mm, repair. I can repair my gun too here. You can see I've got a lot of of things in my backpack. I've got grenade. I've got uh, sulfur duration. If I want to eat something, so I think the blue thing is my Yes, it's my food bar. And the red thing in my health, which is completely legal. So, and I can just put some equipment here. And the equipment do not disappear magically from your inventory. My knife is here, and my jumpsuit is here, but you can see there, here. So, let's go to the next level. And I got plenty of friends here. I'm going to check the gun because I don't want to fight them like that. And I've got a mitten rock rat here, which is going to get a bullet. And um, maybe I'm going to do the next one with them on my knife. Right. Okay, it was all good. So what can I get? Bindings, sun gland. Sometimes there is traps on the doors. Which are very unpleasant. I can unlock the doors if I want with my lock picking skill, and I'm I'm getting XP for that, which is always good. Okay. Is there a way not to move? Just to yes, with with control you can just check the direction. So, staff quarter. I'm, maybe I, I'm, uh, I'm going to be able to repair something. So, yes, if I use my toolkit or my EVA multi tool, I can just repair the thing. Crap, I'm going to be interrupted. Ah, it's repaired, alright. Skill the bat. And see what we can see with that. We're going to use the digital assistant. 
which all these tools are um, need energy, so you need to uh, reload them from time to time when you find some battery station. So what is the message? It's not very comprehensible, uh, unjust understandable. But I'm going to decrypt this letter because I think I've got a fight on my back. All right, so let's kill this thing. All right, got a rat here too. And I've got a bat there. I don't know yet the button to just pass time. Wait. Lots of them here. Alright, level up. So I think there is one more. The point is re ready to eat first. Maybe I could just. Alright, got more friends here. So, do I shoot or not? Maybe not, not yet. Can I use this? Ah, maybe I can't just. I had to do it at the first time. That's a shame. Better level up. I'm going to get some more nice. One more rat. Let's give this one first. I've got plenty more. Okay, so me. I don't know how strong these are, so I'm going just to shoot him in the air. Reload. Alright, so now I need the knife. Get this one. Sonic Noddle. Alright, so. Where to? I need to check the door because I think this one is a trap. If you, if you want, I'm going to show you what's going on when I just activate it. Alright, so let's go through this. So, ah, it was a good trap. This one healed me. Nice. That's the first one I, I, I get. Healing traps are not my most fine things. Alright, so let's repair this one and try to decrypt this thing. Crap. I've got a friend. I'm going to kill it first. I'll try to. To understand what's in there later. Alright, so decrypt. Yes. Uh, medical log. Uh, selective bleeding created subspecies with great aggression. <laughs> Seems not good. Right, let's open this thing. I'll try to take this one with my knife. Come on, come back. Okay, these are not tough. Maybe a little bit than I thought. So what is that? Armor look. I need a good armor. So what's in there for me? I'm on your model. All right, so let's check that. Where do I put these? They could be bad or good. Uh, how do I use it? Maybe I need a bench. Try to cook, cook something with a cooker. So, we should just do this one in there. Alright, so guys, 
I'll do that. And okay, so I've got the stake now. Where to? I'm definitely going to get more enemy around. All right, some more. Oh crap! <laughs> I didn't check my weapon, which was stupid. So I need to get the knife back because I can't just go ahead throwing grenades and all. Plus, I was a little too close for me. All right. So where to? I think it's almost done here. Crap! I didn't see him. Hopefully it's, it's the beginning. <laughs> I would be dead uh, otherwise, I think. Alright, let's talk pick this thing. Is there anybody in there? Yes, there is. Alright, nothing here. Okay. Kill this. Secure weapon locker. Look nice. Let's open this thing. Excellent. Oh, shotgun. Ammo. Energy cell. Everything is good here. So if I just check about shotgun, got a knife. Nice. Is the uh, shotgun? Yes, it's, it's loaded. Loaded. All right. So let's go downstairs. <laughs> Holy crap! It's time for me to try the shotgun. I think. So let's go for this one. Why the security bot? It's too powerful, maybe. Because I just rip his head off. Alright, so I see how powerful is the shotgun now. I got a cybernetic brain. Nice. So, what are these? Lab station. Two lab station. So, let's activate this thing. What can I do? I can research maybe things on these. So, what is that sonic noodle? I'm going to make a research on this one. Yes, go ahead. Nothing, alright. So, I'm going to open this door. Maybe not now, because I'm pretty sure there is some enemy around. Alright, so, it's doable. Okay, let's get this. I need to eat something, it seems. Uh, what do I have? I've got ration. Eat. I need to eat another man. Alright. Should be good enough for now. Okay, there is a bat here. And a robot. Which has d damaged my armor. Crap. This one is tough. Alright, I'm going to shoot him. I don't care if I do noise. I've got enough bullet. Do that. <laughs> Alright, level up. This game is very enjoyable. Not easy. Ah, crap, it was a, a trap. A bad trap, which has. almost. not kill me, but. make me. a lot less healthier. 
storage food and let's bypass this. That went well. What is that? Shell casing, alright. I've got a fridge here, a freezer. Done. Let's get this one. So you can see how works the the fighting. It's, it's just very easy to learn, but probably difficult to to master. I need to repair my knife again. Need some sharpening to be done. All right. So it has a lot less than it, it was. Uh, I need to repair my armor soon. Can I repair this thing? Maybe not. Alright, done. And I spotted a trap here. Get in. I think the fact you can just lockpick all these things and and arc and, and repair and all is really a good addition to the game. Because if it, if it was only sh just shoot them, it would have not have been as fun as it is now. Let's just do that. We got a uh, Takawa braid. Alright, maybe I could just do a sandwich now. Okay, I'm going to shoot all these things down. Not exactly so well the game, but I'm going to be. I'm not going to go further for now, so I'm going to make a lot of noise right now, and I'm going to use the shotgun. So anybody else here? Crap. I would like to just shot the last one. Anyway, guys, it was Sword of the Stars a bit, which is a very good roguelike and a very interesting game of the Indie Rail bundle. I hope you'll like it. Anyway, see you!